Should I go to bed? <sighs> Hello and welcome to Wildflowers. It is a Tuesday, seems to be raining, and today we'll go see Parker about um, maybe doing some work for us. First though, we'll do our chores over here. Hello. It's not my forte, but could I help around the farm? We're a team and I want to do what I can to support you. Uh, I appreciate the offer, but working the farm helps clear my head. Books do the same for me. Do what feels right, sweetheart. Also, there really isn't all that much to do. I can't wait to drink some of this well <laughs> All right. Starting to be halfway towards our next date. Let's see about the pumpkin ale. One pumpkin, one hops, and one sugar. Candle will be done in the uh, evening. Howdy Tara. I was trying to nurse some new perennial seedlings along when inspiration struck. Designs for a bigger tool shed and greenhouse. If you're interested, hit me up at my shop. Come by any time and let me know when you're ready to get started. Parker. Okay, spacious greenhouse and giant tool shed. I want them both. Hello, Miney. And we'll send you back. Hey, Miney. It's off to work you go. Nothing's done in there yet. Can't wait for that corn to be done uh, so I can harvest it and then I'll be able to complete the quest for Marty and we'll get those new farm animals. Well, I'll probably have to wait a while after completing the quest for the new farm animals to show up but well i really want to get going on that it shouldn't be very long until that corn is ready to be harvested though got plenty of pumpkins growing there too Good, because we need quite a few for the different quests that we have. Hello, Pancho. Uh, let's see if I can figure out your favorite today. Apple? Nope, wasn't it. Hello, Layla. Do you like apples? Not especially. Buttercup? We already know your favorite. Matilda? 
Your favorite is still a mystery. Madeline, um, do you like apples? <gasps> you do? Yay! dried apples with you. Well, here's a lime. Oh, nice. So now it's just Matilda and the chickens, whose favorite foods we still need to discover. Hey there, kitty. Cleopatra. Well, obviously, uh, when we get the new farm animals, we'll need Aww, to discover their that, favorites. But for now, before we do get those new farm animals, it's just Matilda and the chickens, whose favorites we still haven't discovered. Natalia? I spent too long being afraid of half the town, and I'm ashamed I did. Just glad no one spits at me when I walk around town. Hmm. All right. Um, let's sell some ingots as well. I know we may need some for those new buildings, but I'm hoping 30 will be enough. Angus? You'd think working with teeny tiny jewels would translate to Francis having some precision in the kitchen, but don't get me wrong. Yeah, we've heard that before. Gloria? I swear, every week I uncover something new that Otto messed up while he was running things. It's more work than I bargained for, but I've never been a quitter. No. Violet? I loved the Harvest Festival when I was a kid. I'm glad it's back to stay. Do we have any of those cloth only outfits? No, we don't. Hmm. We'll have to make some and then maybe tomorrow we'll see how much we can get for them. Parker? Yeah, I do feel like my world got flipped upside down, but... What I don't want to do is fall into the same intolerant NIMBY trash attitude people faced back home. So, hey, you tell me my neighbor is a werewolf? Well, all right then. As long as he's a cool dude. Nah, that's n nice. Um... Which one do we go for? Greenhouse? Hmm, shouldn't have sold those iron ingots. Well, we just need 11 more. I think we have the iron to make 11 more. So I'll be right back. Just gotta make a quick trip back to Natalia's.
Also, that'll take two days, not just one day. Eleven, there we go. Miney will bring us back some iron when he returns. So, uh... I'm hoping we'll have plenty in time for the next building project. I'll get right to work on your greenhouse. More space coming right up. Should only take a day or so. Yay. Nice. Also, maybe every building project won't need iron ingots. We'll see. Amira. Oops. You really helped make all the difference last year. No. It was a group effort. Sophia? Juliet's been excited for the Harvest Fest. She's been telling me all about the magical customs behind jack-o'-lanterns. Bruno? Back when Otto and Kaya ran the pub, Otto wouldn't have dare give him any grief. I think Otto was a bit scared of Kaya. He heard a rumor at school that back in Johannesburg, Kaya was some kind of famous witch doctor. <laughs> Kids. Hmm. Let's sell a few of these fish from cluttering up our inventory. You know, just a, a few of them. Get them out of the way. Damon? Kai's always trying to convince me to join him out on the waves. I enjoy the craft, but it's not really my thing. Hmm. Lena? Hi, Tara. Hi, Lena. You seem to be in a good mood. Oh, I am! Fall is my favorite season in Fairhaven. The foliage, the pumpkin pie, the fact that my kids are back in school full time. Wait. I said the last part out loud, didn't I? <laughs> you sure did. But, um, I'm not judging. I'm always surprised by how safe I feel here. It took a long time for me to find that. Nah. Yeah. I just hope we can figure out who put bunny ears on people and... Oh, the new greenhouse is going to be pretty big. It'll be nice to see it when it's done. I mean, we already saw it in the picture, but... It'll be nice to see it... You know. Um... In action as Maybe well. Maybe I'll let the animals stomp on a pumpkin with their hooves and sit that out front. It'll look about as good as any jack-o'-lantern I try to carve myself. No, oh, Marty. You just need some practice. Kai? Damon's been working on a pumpkin ale for the Harvest Fest. I hope he hits me up. I consider myself a solid taste tester. <laughs> I'm sure you do. I'm sure Damon has no trouble finding taste testers for his new drinks. Let's go and um, do a bit of foraging before we go and check out the coven meeting and water our plants in the gloaming. It'll be great to get a bigger greenhouse. That way, we'll always have space to grow crops, whether they're in season or not. I mean, we do have a little bit of space for that right now too, but 
it'll be nice to have even more space for that. Alright. Let's see if there's anything new here. There probably won't be until the harvest festival. Water our plants. We actually need pretty large quantities of wood again. So I'm thinking on our way back home, we might fell a few trees just uh, stock up on wood a little by little yeah let's start over here This way, we won't need to have like a massive wood chopping operation at any point. We'll just chop a little bit every now and then. So we still have a couple of buildings or building upgrades left to unlock at Parker's. Oh, of course, those will be for the coop and barn, won't they? They will probably unlock once we get the new farm animals. Or like, you know. Once we complete the quest for Marty and uh, and he starts selling new farm animals. There we go. Um yeah, this is where we make the soy milk. Let's make like 20. That'll still leave us 20-ish soybeans. And we'll see about that miso soup. How many do we need? Uh, 12. Okay. There it is. Oh yeah, we need tofu. Let's make the tofu. 12. There we go. That'll leave us with 10 soy milk and we can make all 12 portions of the soup now we just need lots of pumpkins of course we need pumpkins for the uh, those couple of of quests as well. We'll prioritize the quests and then, you know, get the uh, wellspring pumpkins after. All right. Bedtime cuddles. And let's get to bed. 
All right. Um, tomorrow we'll see if the corn is finally ready to harvest. And um, I will also try to remember to make some of those those outfits. You know the ones that are made out of two undyed cloth. We'll see how much we can sell them for and then decide whether we want to make and sell those or whether we want to just sell the cloth. Anyway, for now, thank you so much for spending time with me here on the Mellow. It was lovely to have you. Please remember to be kind to yourself. Have a lovely rest of your day. And I'll see you next time.